Welcome back to Ox Tools. I'm Tom. Um, for all those folks out there that have patiently waited uh, for me to get back onto the etching press, the wait is over, <laughs> it's just so you know. Um, I've kind of cleared out the, uh, the projects that uh, were, eh, I got distracted a little bit, so I'll admit it. And uh, anyway, we're ready to go back on this. Uh, I purchased a bunch of materials. Uh, I've done some uh, of the uh, design work for the next phase and uh, actually got plenty of stuff to show you guys. Anyway, uh, um, just as a reminder what we're doing here, we're building a large uh, printmaking etching press. Um, basic dimensions of the platen are 48 inches by 72 inches, so um, it's pretty good size. So over a meter. Uh, and two meters long. So uh, total weight when it's finished is roughly 3,500 pounds. Okay. Um, anyway, let's take a look at the, uh, we're going to pop over to the, <coughs> excuse me, the welding table. Take a look at uh, what I have set up over there because it's really kind of the next part of the, uh, uh, of the assembly. Um, there's a lot of work in it. It's the lift mechanism for the upper roll. So let's, uh, let's go take a look at that. All right. So here we have uh, all the various pieces kind of laid out in uh, context to one another. Um, so uh, some of you guys, this is kind of where we left off here with these uh, bearing housings. Um, and everything's heavy. <laughs> the, uh, here, this is the bearing that goes, uh, that goes in there. Okay, slip that in. Like so. So there's a, uh, a lift mechanism here uh, that's run, that's synchronized with the opposite side that lifts both of these bearing housing, housings at the same time. Um, this all happens through yet another hand wheel, okay? Um, and a common shaft that runs through these guys, okay? So there's a ton of work in this. Um, I'm doing this work because um, you know, I could work on the rolls, those are all designed and ready to go, but they're big and they're heavy and they'd be in my way until all this stuff is done. So I'm doing the, I would say, the more complex uh, assemblies first, the drive mechanism, the lift mechanism, and then the last things to go will be the, uh, the rolls and the, uh, the main structure of the thing, which is relatively straightforward, so uh, comparatively. Anyway, so let's, uh, let's get in a little closer and I'll show you some of the, the details of this and then uh, uh, we'll talk about what we're going to work on first, which is uh, these uh, vertical supports here. Okay, so here's the, uh, here's the, uh, the top section here and we see we have a little worm gear set. Now, originally I was, I was going to actually make these worm gears, but uh, after doing a, a bunch of calculations about how many turns it would take to lift this and all that, I really ended up having to buy these. Um, this is a uh, this is a four start worm here and a uh, uh, you know with a matching uh, gear and I don't have the ability to uh, to cut those in here at least it's not at that pitch. Uh, my lathe doesn't uh, uh, have a coarse enough uh, pitch to cut that thread so um, I decided to go ahead and buy these. It, it saves a fair amount of work. I kind of wanted to make them, but you know, hey, that's the way it goes. So uh, this will rotate a, a nut that protrudes through this plate here that actuates, or the nut will, the screws fix, the nut will rotate around this and this will raise and lower the, uh, uh, the bearing assembly. Um, let's see here. These are so to support the worm and uh, provide a uh, place for the shaft, uh, we have these bronze plates here that actually fit in like so. There'll be one on either side and a uh, common shaft will run through these. And uh, these were water jet cut. Uh, my buddy uh, Monkey Like Shiny helped me with that. I, I got the bronze and uh, he, got, he has the water jet. So somebody's happy. <laughs> This was left, a uh, little note left with, from uh, my wife. <laughs> it's kind of cute. Anyway, uh, so that's that. Um, so that's kind of the basic details. Um, I don't know. We could talk about this for days here, but uh, what do you say we uh, go ahead and do some work, huh? So this is kind of the reboot uh, video here. So uh, get this thing going again. Yeah. 